YouTube, what it do? It's your boy, King Zay, back in the stew, so I'm saying. Don't look at my background, man. I'm back there folding clothes, so I'm saying. But Pete, man, different type of video today, bro. We got the 10 fattest people in the world, bro. Now, <laughs> all right, listen, I'm not even going to go hard this video, bro. You know, I'm a chill, but if I see a joke, that needs to be said is getting said, bro. And I'm not even against eaters. Because by all means, shorty, you can eat this meat in my back seat. And at the end, I promise you're going to get a white sticky treat. You know what I'm saying? But, nah, but for real though, bro. Nah, if you an eater, I already know that you a eater. See what I'm saying? So I'm going to let you do what you do best. But... All that being said, though, bro, we can't even peep the thumbnail today, bro, because the thumbnail is so crazy. I'm not trying to get banned. But, uh, hey, man, let peep. Hello, dear viewer, and welcome to yet another riveting oh, no. episode of 100 M. She got the lucky the lean demon gut. Oh, Whoa. she was rubbing that belly. For 10, Donna Simpson, 630 pounds. <sighs> While the rest of the world was counting calories and trying to slim down, Donna Simpson upped her food intake to an alarming 15,000 calories per day, wanting to become the fattest woman ever. She earned 15, her mammoth house and treats performing as a supersized big beautiful web model where she ranked in over $90,000 a year. A big fat ch What's what are y'all is paying for this 90 bands? Hold on, I might have to get my weight up. Check paid by chubby chasing admirers who love to watch her eat. At her peak weight, Simpson exceeded 600 pounds. But most people recall a comparatively Stop! Stop it right now. Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna call her out right now. Shorty, what 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 is you doing eating the salad? Don't come on here trying to be a pretender. Show me that five course dinner you got in the background. Like, come on now. Show me that what you wanted, Dunkin' Donuts? Like, show me them donuts you got hidden back there. Because that was her weight around the time she got pregnant with her baby girl Jacqueline. She earned That's the crazy. Guinness World Record title for the I always woman wondered. to give birth. I like, say you do weigh 600 plus pounds to become the pregnant. fattest woman. Will you even she notice? Herself was jilted by her fiance so much and gut her just her in front you. Number nine, Monica Riley, 700 pounds. <sighs> Morbidly obese funnel feeding model Monica Riley wanted to become the world's fattest woman as well. Like Donna Simpson, she was ready to spend her days gorging on piles of food to achieve the Ooh. big goal. At her heaviest, Monica weighed a colossal going. seven. I'm sorry, bro. I gotta let them choose the thoughts. To win, achieve bro. the dog, oh, she got the 99 overall stretch belly build, bro. It's like it's like she rubbing eight stomachs at once, bro. <laughs> like at her come heaviest, on, bro. Monica weighed at a colossal point, you know you gotta lose weight, bro. Pounds, but but why, swore not to stop at that. With a gut busting diet of 10,000 calories a day, the fattish she, model from Fort Worth, Texas, was well on her way to hitting her target weight of 1,000 pounds. And basically so she becoming wanted to get to fat. Move. Now, this is crazy. Her fiance Sid Riley spent most of his time catering to her insatiable appetite for high calorie shakes. Her shakes contained liberal amounts of double cream, Pop Tarts, milk, and weight gain powder. Are <laughs> totally y'all here to announce and trying not to laugh or the commentators? And with 20,000 online fans watching, Monica guzzled it all in eat, a very eat, original eat, way. Eat, 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 ugly. <laughs> Number eight. <laughs> Shannon Lowry, 739 pounds. Ugh. Weighing in at 739 Ooh. pounds at her heaviest, Shannon Lowry is one of the heaviest women on this list. Jeez. Most people know her from the recently that broadcast breakfast? episode of the show My 600 Pound Life, starred by world famous weight loss surgeon is Dr. She? Now. Oh, no, on the episode, pain. the 39 year old okay. narrates her grueling journey becoming morbidly obese practically her entire adult life. The struggle has oh, never been man. easy on her since Look weighing her 100 place. pounds at age 7 and 450 pounds by age 17. When she finally Look decided to enlist 17. the help of Dr. Now last year, Lowry was at her heaviest. Oh, she tipped the scales man. at 739 like pounds when the good doctor slider. weighed her from his Houston, Texas office. At the time, Shannon no. relied on her husband. Dude, is she a real deal linebacker, cuh? Shot a guy, one, two, three, four, five. Five, sixteen backs, bro. What? What's the? What's the? What's the NFL linebacker name, bro? What's the? Bro, Lawrence Taylor don't got nothing on her, bro. Get her in the league ASAP. And Simon Dude. Johnson for pretty much she everything. The, <laughs> duty she which protected she everything. Religiously for the ten years they had been married since meeting while gaming online. 
Since appearing on Dr. Now's show, to lose Shannon's weight, weight loss journey it. seemed incredible as she lost 41 pounds initially. However, she reported recently that her progress since stalled. <sighs> Number 7. Susan Iman, 800 pounds. <sighs> Feasting mostly on astonishingly enormous meals that add up to a terrifying 30,000 calories per day, does it come as a surprise that morbidly obese? Hold on, why is she kind of looking a little cute right there? You know, hold on, don't hold your stomach like that. Susan Emin like you once tipped the scales at more than eight hundred <laughs> pounds. She got through heavy breakfasts, greasy snacks with sugar. Snack? Come, on, bro, come on, bro. Snack or heart attack? What am I looking at, bro? This is a snack? I'm what, bro, bro? If this is a snack, what y'all think dinner look like, bro? What y'all think? breakfast lunch what y'all think a day in her life of eating looks like if this is a snack bruh dude come on bruh three shakes and mammoth dinners mammoth dinners she too Yo, hoped chill, to become bruh. the world's fattest woman and america's largest bride she oh. was at the time engaged to be married to chef fiance parker clack her two sons were however not okay with the life-threatening mission I mean, I get it, they though. understandably feared for, for their real. mother's health and well-being Hearing her son's concerns, Suzanne sought professional assistance from a residential weight loss clinic and shed off nearly half of her weight okay. ahead of her 2013 big day. When she slimmed down incredibly from an 800 pound big yeah. beautiful woman to a mere 450 pounds, her fiance Parker Clack thought she had changed too much and called off the wedding. Fortunately, what? Suzanne found a new love. You broke up with her because she was skinny? A few short years later, and together I mean, with her new catch, Nick the, Abate, the, yeah, they set out on a line. mission to get her back My to her apologies. previous size. Double her and pass it to me. Barry Austin, Big 910 B. pounds. Going <sighs> by Fat Baz, Barry Austin was dubbed Britain's fattest man. I ain't gonna lie, he looked like a cool fat dude. dude. You know how, I ain't gonna lie, bald fat dudes for some just be the funniest pounds. people alive. His peak weight was confirmed at a titular Sky One documentary where Barry admitted to ravaging through 29,000 calories a day and drinking up to 12 liters of fizzy drinks at a time. Barry acknowledged dude. the dark side of his lifestyle and was trying to slim down for his health when a number of health issues presented. He lost 280 pounds after having a okay. gastric balloon fitted and slashing his caloric intake to a limited 1,500 okay, calories per day. Okay. In a message to his longtime pal and fellow blues fan, broadcaster Tom Ross, Barry said that he was struggling after losing a lot of weight as he had been bedbound for six years. Jeez. Sadly, Barry passed away on January 1st no. this year after suffering a heart attack. I ain't gonna lie, no, 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 no. I ain't gonna lie, no, no, no. R.I.P. Barry for real, though. Ricky no Jr. Naputi, 900 pounds. Well uh. known as the Guamanian man who ate himself to I think death, I've seen Ricky this Naputi documentary of Ricky, though. I ain't gonna lie, this is sad. And I, his wife, his labored struggle nah, I respect was his wife in a stay TLC documentary end, called 900 Pound Man. At the time, Ricky was too heavy to do anything. He hadn't walked on his own for more than seven years. Jeez. He couldn't talk without running out of breath, and he was too fat to even consummate his marriage. Yeah, Perhaps the only thing that came easy for him was insisting on way. more food. Lots and lots of it. Ricky desperately needed life-saving surgery, but all the doctors he contacted required that he loses at least 90 pounds on his own first, since it would have been too dangerous to try and perform gastric surgery Ooh, given his condition at the like... time. In the end, it's like, at this point, you just don't care about yourself, though. To help like, come on, bro. Him, Ricky fell oh, into deep depression I, I don't even want to roast him. Like, it, it, he died it in so November sad. 2012 at age 39, with doctors declaring morbid obesity as the cause of his death. Number 4. Carol Ann Yeager, 1,189 pounds. As the only I... woman to hit 1,200 pounds, Perhaps 1,600 pounds so officially. Crazy, Carol Ann Yeager was what? Yo, all right, hang on, all right, no, no, this is disrespectful. Why is they dragging her like that? Severely obese like, woman in history. Good, 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 Cameraman, what you needed a raise or something? Did you have to zoom in like that? It like, well, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> w angle, I ain't gonna lie, bro. In you know what you're doing. She developed as a child. She said that she found temporary relief in her sweet treats. Life for her was never a piece of cake. Come on, bro. That's too easy, bro. Jaeger felt give me a harder joke to come up with, bro. That's too many easy, bro. <laughs> come on. Over the course of her life, at her heaviest, Jaeger was mostly immobile and became totally dependent on her 14-year-old daughter Heather and son Stephen Bishop, I, 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 among I other helpers, bro. including Dude, friends. Dude, imagine. Nurses. 
and her I'll be feeling bad for the kids mostly, bro. Because it's like the kids that got to become the parents in this type of situation. In a restricted 1,200 calorie diet, Imagine you had to take care of your 1,000 pound mom. She died at her home in the year that followed, with kidney failure listed as the cause of death and morbid uh, obesity being the contributing cause. One can never hope to retell Yeager's thousand pound you know, life in you know, about a hundred words, you know but putting her on this list dirty, is like, a start. I respect the kids. Number three, Khalid bin Mohsen Shari, 1,345 pounds. <sighs> Dude. Once the heaviest living person and the second heaviest person ever recorded, Saudi Arabian Khalid bin Mohsen Shari weighed 1,345 pounds at his peak weight. On, Unable to move bro. on his own, Shari was confined Dog. to his bed for a little over three years, a situation which prompted Saudi King Abdullah to intervene. The king had a... <laughs> Hold on, bro. Jeffrey, please get out of my face. Bro, imagine being so big, the king has to... Wait, what did they say the king had to do? over three years, a situation which prompted Saudi King Abdullah to intervene. Bro, imagine being so big the king has to <laughs> has to handle your weight. Shari was then transferred from his Jazan home in the south to be treated in the King Fahad medical city in Riyadh, where he lost a massive 700 pounds through a combination of gastric band surgery, what? rehabilitation, strict exercise regimen, and healthy eating. His While ounce? his loss was remarkable, Shari needed to trim down a further 218 pounds to become the biggest loser in history, a record held by American Rosalie Bradford, who had lost 917 pounds to clinch the title. Some sources say, however, that Shari ultimately slimmed down to a friendly weight of 150 pounds That's cap. after losing a- I need to see some before I act the pictures, because there's no weight. So you telling me he lost, what, 900, 1,000 pounds? No, I need to see before and after. There's just no way. Y'all, y'all lying. 1, now, this is this is a myth. 195 pounds. Wait, how many? 150 pounds. Dude, they had to lift his bed in the air. I'm just peeking. Some sources say, Yo. however, that Shari ultimately slimmed down to a friendly weight of 150 pounds after losing a whopping 1,195 pounds and basically making him the biggest the facts. loser in I history. Need to see the car facts the fat now facts, it's bro. time for today's no best pick. Hey, buddy. Number one, John Brower Minoke, 1,400 pounds. <sighs> Record books list John Brower Whoa, Minoke. Whoa, wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. 1,400 pounds and he's walking? As the heaviest man ever recorded. Dude! He's estimated to have weighed more than 1,400 pounds, but his sheer size... Nah, he don't even... All right, hear me out. He don't even look fat, though. Like, the fact that he's walking, he probably really just bulking up, bruh. And he's just waiting to cut at this point. Health and this cut gonna be crazy the way he do it, you know, you know. Scale. If Bainbridge Island, Washington had skills that big. No matter, Minoke took the title for heaviest person ever, and there's no arguing that fact. Yeah. He also landed another rather interesting title for the greatest difference in weight between a married couple when his 110-pound fiance Jeanette said, I do, on their big day. Despite suffering from obesity since childhood, Minoke's weight was never an issue until being diagnosed with massive generalized edema, a condition Jeez. which doctors determined to be incurable and difficult to treat. Minoke got even bigger until his dramatic hospitalization due to congestive heart failure. About a dozen firefighters and medics had to join hands to put him on a modified stretcher and onto a ferry to get him to the University of Washington Medical Center. His treatment plan included a strict diet cut to 1,200 calories per day, which saw him lose as much as 900 pounds, earning him a final distinction for the biggest- But what did I just say? He was just bulking up for the cut! Hey man, WV, I won't lie. If y'all want more vids like this, bro, I ain't gonna lie. This was one of the crazy, not one of the crazy I've ever reacted to, but this was one of them ones, see what I'm saying? So if y'all want me to react to more vids like this, bro, just let me know, see what I'm saying? We can do more, some more top tens. And uh, all that being said, though, appreciate y'all staying through to the end. Hey, it's your boy Kingsley signing out, man. Peace!